everybody and welcome back to Shovel Knight. Today we are going to the Hall of Champions. What do you have to say for yourself, Peacock Lady? And mission is 5,000 gold. Oh, wait. Excuse me? Oh, I used all my money. Well, I guess we can't do that first. Hopefully I will have 5,000 gold by the time I come back. So, let us play this area. I, I generally get quite a bit of gold from these areas, so I, I think I should be able to do it just fine. Although I'm not a, like I said before, I'm not a fan of these sort of dark areas. Gotcha. Major look. Don't fall. I really want those emeralds because they're worth a lot. Oh! Okay. Recover. I will recover. Come on. It's very Mario 3-esque. Oh my gosh. This is just embarrassing. You'd think I never played a platformer. I've played a platformer. Oh yes. Yes I have. Now what? Look Knight, I have no qualms with you. Look at the fat gems. Oh man, ow. Oops. I really gotta stop wasting my magic like that. I mean, I, I have a lot, but still. Oh, I got him. I got him. Oh, you know what? I, I could even get this last one here. There we go. Is that a fishing hole? No. Oh, uh, uh, there we go. I really don't like this sort of area. Come on, get your butt back over here. I'm not finished with you. Hopefully this is enough to do him in, and it was. Awesome. I mean, the pits are obvious enough, but I'm not confident enough to, to mess with it, basically. What is this? Shortcut. I don't know about that. Let's go fight this guy again. With you by our side, Black Knight. Total Dominion is within our grasp. I beg of you, take my words to heart. Your safety is my only concern. What is this? The plot thickens. Was that the Enchantress? Tell me what- You! Haven't you tired of this charade? Stay out of this. You never were one to blindly follow Black Knight, but the order in the Enchantress must be stopped. Fool! You're headed down a ruinous path. The only path I seek leads to the Tower of Fate, and I will reach it. Never steal that shovel. Look, we've been over this before. Oh no, you have more life. We've been over this before. I don't think you understand. And I don't think he's got any any new moves up his sleeve either. But I do. Ow. Oh, he does do that, I suppose. Look, we can't both do the same move. There we go. Laugh now, will ya? And he's just about gone. What the heck? Okay, 
He does have a new move up his sleeve. Not enough, though. No... No victory music? He ran off. He didn't run off last time, I don't think. Frigid Flight. I don't think I can do that yet. Okay, what's this shortcut about? Oh. Huh? What does this do? I don't remember. Oh. Awesome. That, surprisingly, was useful. It gave me just enough to get into the Hall of Champions. I, I wasn't expecting that. It's gotta be said. And now we can get up there. I still don't have like a horn or anything, so okay. Okie dokie. Now let's go to the Hall of Champions. Alright, Peacock Lady. Let's see you laugh at me this time. Wonderful. Clearly a discerning patron of the arts. Enjoy your visit. Yeah. Okay. This place is haunted. There are ghosts roaming the halls and we're all trapped here. Yeah, the door did close, didn't it? That includes you. So, are you going to do something about it? Well, I mean, what's the other option? Just leave the game running forever? This, we'll be back here. It's a cool little room. And, um, let's see. There's... This room is pretty cool, too, because these are actually all avatars of backers. So, I think that's true. I think. Oh. Right, there's, a uh, platforms. And it's wherever the knights are. That's Those are holes, I think. I want to get this before I talk to you. <laughs> Cultured fellow. Okay. Oh, great! You blew my secret hiding spot. Now the ghosts will get us both. Okie dokie. Now there's these orbs that uh, have a dual purpose. Of course, I can't remember. Oh, wow. I forgot that they could be used to not only banish those, or, well, to hit those guys, but also to give me some money out of them. There we go. Awesome. There we go. I knew there was a way to get up there. Hello? I can't believe I saved up all my money for this. Yeah, me too. I've learned during my travels that ghosts have hate light. Now you know too. Yeah, well, this is pretty obvious, really. I thought there was a way to turn the lights on. I'm, I'm positive that there is. Oh, do I have to kill all the ghosts? I might have to kill all the ghosts, I forget. Is that the puzzle? I think that might be the puzzle. Come on, Ghost Man Jones. There we go. Ah! Perfect. So I actually do need to go back to screen. Because I didn't get all the ghosts. There's none in this room, I don't think. There's definitely some in this room, though. There we go. Anything in here? 
No. Oh, wait. There is something in here. The alphabet. So, I'm assuming that you can translate something. It's oh, right. So, like, let's take the top right guy. I'm assuming those are initials. So, it'd be like... Uh, what was it? DC or something like that? I think. That's a pretty cool way of creating a language like that. You know, it's pretty pixely. It's pretty hard to read. But they gave you a, a way of, of making it happen. Unfortunately, there's a lot of empty space in this little area, so it's not a whole lot to talk about, but there are some special areas and secret areas and things. The ghosts will never reach me in here. Solid walls, my friend. Totally safe. Right. One, solid walls don't help you in that situation. And secondly, I just made it not a solid wall by sticking my shovel directly through it. Have fun. <laughs> How do I... What it... Okay. I'm getting really tired of using up my magic too, so... Oh, I didn't actually need that. Whatever. And, yes, I will get a lot more than 5,000 back before beating this area. Did I miss something? I probably missed this room. Oh, yeah, I did. And the orb is in here. Man, I didn't play through this level very well, did I? Dodge, dodge, dodge. That was a very lucrative room. Wow, that guy's pretty cool. I didn't notice Dragon Head Man. Oh my gosh. So many ghosts. You, you gave me, literally, you gave me the objects to your demise. That just doesn't seem wise. And... I'm not a huge fan of this boss fight. It, it's not really that interesting in my opinion. But maybe that's just me. I mean, it's it's interesting enough, but it's kind of boring, I think. Which, maybe that's not fair, but that's how I feel about it, so... You can't win them all. This aside, the game is amazing. Done. Gotcha. Hey, it wasn't actually dark outside. So I paid 5000 to get in, I got 10000 when I was done. Not bad. Thank you so much for saving us from the ghost menace. How thoughtless of me not telling you the place was haunted. Uh huh. Th then again, that's the risk you run, paying for something in advance before you know the details. Uh huh. That's uh, like a hint, hint, nudge, nudge at the Kickstarter community. Please allow me to reward you for your gallant bravery. Oh. Thanks. 50 gold. 1% of what I pay to get in. Uh, it doesn't matter. Um, the thing is, they have a point. You shouldn't just back things willy-nilly. But that's, you know, that's another discussion for another day. So, that's all for this episode. Next time we'll go to the Stranded Ship, and then we'll complete the Frigid Flight as well. And then, 
Uh, probably the video after that will be a back-to-back -back boss level since it's just those two levels open. Uh, so thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Please give me some feedback and all that good stuff, and I will see you all next time.